<sighs> Welcome to a let's play of Hi Hi Puffy Ami Yumi. Sure, I think it is. Kaznapped. Yeah, the result of me being bored at quarter to three in the morning and going on cool ROMs, downloading the first GBA ROM I see. I'm not really expecting much from this. I mean, I enjoy the show, and to be honest, it's not a bad band. Well, yeah, actually, quite a good band. Depends how much you're into your J pop. And now we are treated to a terrifying pixelated version of Ami and Yumi. I don't think I'll ever sleep again. Yeah, the pixelated photos I don't do much good. Is there going to be any part of this game which isn't horrifically scary? What's with a weird rattle thing? Put it to a nice 16 bit rendition of the opening theme there. So I'm gonna guess that A's jump, B's attack. Wait, why the hell do you punch? Why not use your guitar? Whoa! What to jump over a gap in a platform? Huh, if I do that. You're saying that somehow this small purple haired girl can, with relative ease, my lad, push a block that. One and a quarter times bigger than it. I didn't actually read the instruction because I'm a retard. And again, I didn't actually read the instructions. Button. Fucking hell, because of the stretch of the screen, I kept thinking it was saying B button. There we go, finally using the guitar as a weapon. Makes more sense than using this. Oh, Ah, so I get it. Yuna's the combat character. I mean, yeah, that one's Yuna. Yeah, I get it now. The controls of this game are terrible. It feels like you're controlling a lead weight. You don't want to attack fans. Um, and then we have the music buffer. Die, bastard! Oh, if only this were real life. Happy grin on his face, he gets punched in the face by a pink haired girl. And then game points for petting a cat. Games make no sense when you think about it. And there's. Seriously, this for kids, I think. I don't even need an extra life. The combat's easy as fuck, the platforming's like controlling a lead weight.
sure this is Puffy on Eevee and not actually the Hoop? No, if it was the Who, Roger would for it. No, Pete Townsend would be touching it. Well, I thought that would be up, didn't I? Oh no, because it would be such a loss if I missed. It would be such a fucking loss if I lost five minutes of my life in this game. But to be honest, it doesn't seem very good from the outset. Prob well, there's no probably about it. It's a terrible caption. So, does the... Why do they look so terrifying? Seriously, stop bringing them up. They are scary. The one on the right, I'm not quite sure which it is because it's that fucking disfigured. It literally has a white face. And I forget which button starts because I'm not scared. I'm forgetting what button it is, is it? Eh. Oh, that's it. So it's the uh, cutscene. The thing next to the... Oh, let me try that again. <laughs> the character portrait next to the speech book make it, makes everyone look like they're wearing some kind of hooded coat. In fact, I thought Kaz was at the start. The hell is going on there? <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, it's not... Oh, I remember her from one episode. It's been quite a while since I've actually watched any of the episodes. I recommend watching them actually, they're quite good. As far as kids TV shows go, it's actually pretty decent. No Spongebob, though. I don't think any kids TV show will ever be Spongebob. That's right, two teenage, well three teenagers get beaten by what appears to be a ten year old child with fucking laser vision or something seriously. <laughs> what? <laughs> what the hell was that? And now cats free them in their, from their mess and three lips. Apparently those cats have the biggest mouth known to man. I'm going to rub the guitar wildly and smack the floor repeatedly. It's probably better than playing this game, to be honest. Right. I'll choose Yumi, because she isn't like controlling the brick. What, 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 what? Oh! No. Planning press down. So what the hell is going on there? Is the, the fan like molesting them or something? Okay, so apparently I got molested by a fan today. And I keep forgetting the blue button. Right, even though Yumi controls like a fucking lead weight. She does have higher jumps. And... Uh, Numberella. Or something. Seriously, the control of this game is terrible. I mean, I'm a fan of Puffy and Yumi and all, but I don't think I could force myself to play through this. The graphics, I mean, the sound isn't too bad, but the graphics are fucking awful. So I don't need to card in my name. Uh, nope, shit, wrong button. I'm playing on an emulator, you're gonna get my lot. I'm watching an old Who concert. Nope, wrong button again. Wait, did she just claw those boxes? The game's also not very specific about what you can and can't hit. It's an all-around badly designed game and an obvious cash in on the cartoon. Are you being deadly serious? A camera that shoots fucking noise again. How many times have you made that bomb mistake? Apparently, the guitar. Apparently, that guitar is the hardest thing I've ever made. Go on side, one. Now, 
punch control led way ago. I wouldn't recommend playing this game at all. It's a fucking clusterfuck in terms of the gameplay. The graphics is just playing creepy. And well to be honest the music's alright, but you could just buy a greatest hit CD of Puffy on Yumi and listen to it. And it would be much, 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 much better than suffering through this off well it's not an awful game, it's just a very average game. And that wraps up.